Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Is everyone ready? Are you ready? I'm ready as I can be. No, I guess I'm ready as well. Yeah, we're ready. Okay, uh, uh, three, two, one, go. Hey. So yeah, this is Quake. I'm Elgu, and that's yeah, you've seen me. Yeah, that that boy. <laughs> Yeah, um, hopefully everyone knows this game. Um, what I'm doing here is uh, bunny hopping. The first game that had bunny hopping was Quake. And there's uh, quite a lot of games that are based off this engine. That's why uh, s even some modern games have bunny hopping. And yeah, um, what else? I shoot people and I jump. And get Ooh, keys. That was, that was yeah, really yeah close. I, I was kind of slow there. And um, while I uh, do bunny hops, I sometimes I press forward when I land, and it uh, keep lets me keep the momentum a bit. Yeah, there's basically like two ways of doing bunny hops. There's the, an easy way of just uh, strafing left and right in midair, and just jumping again and again. And there's like a harder version where you uh, press forward every time you land so you try to get even more speed uh, when you land and yeah. you also like uh, do the strafing so it's uh, kind of harder but it's uh, it's a little bit faster yeah and what here i got was the uh, grind launcher and um yeah i did some uh, grind jumps and you're gonna see quite a lot of it just Later like on, in, yeah, in any good game, you can uh, damage boost yourself, and this is the perfect example. Yeah, and uh, this map, uh, I'm gonna try and do the hard way, and it's obviously the fast way. What a legend! Of course. Oh no, not quite. Let's just uh, warm up. Is the real one? Oh, come on! <laughs> but yeah, basically, you need you would normally get the silver key right there. But I'm trying to like skip it. There this is go. pretty much segmented strats, yeah. And this this strat is really hard. But if you are aiming for a good time, you have to get this strat. Basically, all the top ten runs have it. Here, I'll wait a little bit since there's gonna be a fiend here. Oops. Oh no. Don't worry, he's still here. It's my buddy. Yeah, this fiend is like sort of annoying, but he's really useful because you can uh, do a grenade uh, boost off of him. Grenade jump. Yeah, and now uh, uh, I also have the uh, uh, rocket launcher, and I'm gonna use it on the last map, which is, well, last map of this e episode which is here and here I'm gonna try and uh, surf on top of the enemy like that yeah this guy is really big side. I don't think yeah. you can do it on any other enemies but on this guy it's really useful yeah and that's it that's the boss we killed one of the demons of the outer world or whatever he's <laughs> defending yeah, some world. yeah um yeah that was the first boss of the first episode yeah, this game has some deep lore. You just get the into the portal and you save the world somehow, I think. That's exactly how it goes. And yeah, uh, now I lost all my previous weapons and I'm in episode 2. Um, and yeah, I'm, I need to collect the weapons back. And there I picked up a, a quad damage, so I'm like doing pretty big boy damage right now. Oh You're no. doing quad damage. Yeah. Wait, what did I say? <laughs> big boy damage. I mean, it is big boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's pretty well, big so boy. Yeah, sort of true. Yeah, uh, you can just like keep zombing with your um, shotgun. Boomst boomstick. Boomstick, yeah. And here it is kind of funny sequence, if I get it. You slide on the top of the enemy there again. 
nice. every time. Easy. Nice. That's that's important. There's basically there's uh, this guy with a chainsaw after the door op that opened, and he's always in the way. If you're taking too slow with those two grenades, uh, he's gonna get in the way, and you have to kill him as well. And that's like five seconds gone. And in this game, every second counts. Yeah. Um, the bunny hop sequence in the last map was kind of it's well, it's not precise, but you need to have enough speed to go over the cap ga gap. And then uh, also have you, you need to fire a grenade midair. Yeah, basically what he did there, he uh, went to hug the shambler because if you're close to him, he starts doing a melee attack. Yeah, and it's uh, he just can it's come like close easy to him. To, uh, yeah, and to bait the attack and then just leave. I'm gonna try and do the hard strat. Oh no. Oh no. No, I'm not gonna do the hard strat. But didn't you just save? No? Didn't you? Uh, this is not sin. Sorry. Single segment. And there's uh, Ogre. Say hi to him. Oh. Oh. Do you have enough? Uh, let's see. Yeah. This should be fine, I guess. Yeah, here I get stuck on the elevator. Risky, I guess. Um, no, it's fine. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Is that the end of the run? It's time to reset. <laughs> I guess I'll reset. <laughs> oh no! I guess yeah. you can try the hard strat again, right? Yes. <laughs> Actually, I missed the uh, health. Yeah, you missed so. the health. You need like at least 90 for that kind of armor. Yeah, basically, there are three types of armor in this game. I think Quake introduced it. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, there's green, red, and uh, yellow. Um, but Doom has just armor. Well, I mean, when you overcharge. Or like yet more than a hundred. Ah, yeah, that's true. But oh in, no. in this game, basically, there's like the um, different type of armor gives you like more protection oh. and less protection. So basically, red is pretty good, like the best one you can get. Yellow is mediocre, and the worst one is green. But yeah, in this map, I'll just uh, wait for the elevator to oh go, no. go down. Yeah, um, you could speed this up by going get a weapon, and you can even kill like kill the um, um, enemy, the last enemy of this map, early. But uh, I missed it. And it's nice I mean, it's waiting. okay. Uh, the strat is uh, kind of hard. Yeah, and it's it saves precise. like what a five five seconds. I'm not sure. It's it still look, looks cool, better than waiting around, but yeah, it's all right. Oh yeah, yeah. wait up. Uh, is there gonna be another nade, nade boost? Maybe uh, later on, yeah. I'm gonna boost <laughs> there. That's with forty four everyone. <laughs> yeah, got ye. But yeah, that's uh, episode two done. And yeah, again, I lose my weapons, so I collect them again. Yeah, and it's, yeah it's, it's really nice, uh, the hub system. Yeah. Um, yeah, about the t timing the grenades. Uh, timing the grenades, uh, I use the boomstick. Like, I shoot it four times, and after I shot the fourth shot, it means, like, the grenade is gonna explode in a... Know, like half a second or something, so it's a good and easy way to uh, time it. Yeah, basically there's like no good way of timing it just by counting in your head or something like that. It's just simple and nice, nice way of doing it. Since you always have boomstick for it. Oh no. But yeah, um, the next map, it's uh, yeah here I'm actually gonna use the timing method. 
But yeah, this map, it's, it has a lot of enemies and really tight spaces. It's like a really easy place to uh, oh, you die. Get the yeah. Basically, yeah, in this section you can just like get stuck and, uh, and die, but that's not gonna happen, think, right? Yeah. No, no. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> easy. He doesn't time. like me. And yeah, here's gonna be a, a little different. Uh, great jump here. You do it out of the water. Yeah, this one is actually a lot harder because you have to uh, swim up uh, right before the grenade explodes. So the timing is different, not yeah. the same uh, like you use for, for in the underground. Ooh, spicy boost. Uh, I think it's the second last map of episode 3 and here I think it's the only time you uh, the map map, uh, map makers use the uh, wind tunnels wind tunnel system yeah it's the only map and it's and it's so weird uh, kind of design I think yeah basically it's just like fly around in the pipes yeah that's about it <laughs> yeah and then there are flo flooded pipes yeah uh, that you go through as well. So it's like a pipe factory or something. And yeah, that's that map done. And uh, and as you've seen uh, in episode two, the last boss was actually just a regular enemy. Like in episode. Oh wow! Oh, that was a nice air shot by the yeah. by the fiend. Um, I don't think that ever happened before. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. He usually lands when you're on lands on you when you're on the ground. Yeah. Basically, he can crush you easily just by landing on top of you. And he just did that, I guess. Or he just damaged you. In, in, in yeah, in the air. Yeah. That's pretty amazing. But I mean, it's okay. Uh, you can still do the map again. Yeah, uh, episode one is basically like one of the only maps that has like a proper boss at the end. Uh, episode 2 had just a regular type enemy at the end and uh, mm, easy every time nice. by the way. Um, that, was, that, was, that was pretty good. And episode 3 had like two normal types and then episode 4 is a secret. I mean episode 1 was the, the shareware yeah. version. I yeah, think. yeah. They wanted to hype everyone up with yep, the episode with the, 1. With the boss and, and the good levels. Yeah. Oh, missed the mega. Doesn't matter, I guess. Um, just nice. I think. Yeah. yeah, you get a little boost there with the, well, the lightning. Shambler, yeah, Shambler yeah. lightning. Basically, all he does is just like the perfect sequence of jumps, and uh, he goes like this because it's fast. Oh. Oh. The next jump is he's gonna try to do. There's like a teleport from the end section of uh, the level, and he's gonna land on top of the teleport and yeah, then strafe. Yeah, I'm gonna save here since um, it's pretty hard. The uh, mouse mat I'm using, I never used it, so it's a bit different. Nice. But yeah, that was that was first try actually. Yeah, it it was harder to, to get on top of the on top of the teleporter. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The jump itself is pretty much. It has to be like this a certain way of moving your mouse and uh, certain key inputs. Mail who just made it look easy. Yeah, now we got the uh, crane launcher again. So that means big boy business. Yeah, hopefully we're gonna do a quad damage boost. Yeah, yeah, there's a uh, quad damage to I which I just picked up. Get rid of the enemies on the way. And we have a long corridor in front of us, but I mean. Oh, oh. Hit, the, hit the edge. Never lucky. Never lucky. The jumps of shame. <laughs> we still got a 49. That's that's fine. Everything's fine. Just fine. There's nothing to worry about. And then we're gonna do another rock, uh, another grenade jump. Yeah, over some fishes. 
Ooh, the fancy way. The way. Um, is it? Is I, it slower? I think so. Just a little bit. Let's try and do this the fancy way. Ooh, yeah. nice. That's the segment that's tried. Uh, the normally you have to just slow down on the stairs. Yeah. And then there is you can just skip the whole level just by jumping on uh, on those on those things at the end the uh, at the end of the level. And yeah, again at the start of the map I picked up a uh, quad damage and uh, mega health. So here I'm gonna use this. Oh. Ooh. I think it's fine. No, it's not. <laughs> Yeah, quad damage. Yeah, I hit the uh, edge of the uh, entrance, I think. So basically, yeah, quad damage is not only against the enemies, it's, it's against yourself as well. And uh, the amount of uh, boost you get is, is bigger as well. And another mega health. And also, I picked up the red armor, because like here, in this map, I can do an extra boost here because I had the uh, red armor from last map. Yeah, this uh, the last map was basically uh, just a, a lot of oh. jumping. Yeah, lots Big of uh, boosts here on the uh, stairs. Yeah, you you, ha you get a rocket launcher and you have like really wide corridors, so you can just do that. Yeah, and the uh, last enemy of. This episode is coming up. I'll actually pick this up. Yeah, just just to be safe. Pentagram gives you inv invulnerability. So yeah, let's uh, see who's the boss. Oh, I've seen this boss. Oh no, Wait, it's never. already dead. What? That's a terrible boss. Yeah, they basically just made the episode one look good and then just kind of meh. Episodes. They're smash, still, they're smash still everything good, everything but everything else together, yeah. But I mean, technically, uh, the tech stuff of the game, like the 3D and stuff, it was uh, game break, uh, like groundbreaking for everyone. So everyone loved it anyway. Yeah, and uh, this is the last map, by the way. So get ready on time. Yeah, you can't really kill this big tentacle thing. What are you? Wha wha what can you do, Elgo? Yeah, I don't know. There's this weird ball floating around. Yeah, I guess. Maybe. I guess, um, boom. Time. time. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of weird. It's you need to notice that the ball is like floating around, and you can like telefrag the final boss by entering the teleporter while the ball is <laughs> ball is inside <laughs> the enemy. Well, yeah. That was quick. Shout outs to my mom. Shout outs <laughs> to Abigail as well. And everyone who's watching here and at home as well. Yeah, next and last is Doom. Yep. With Wake Cold. Watch it. <laughs>